Hi crafty friends, it's Caroline and I am back today. I'm so excited. I am back with a new collaboration and this is another collaboration that is hosted by Crystal Rose over at Vividly on Paper and um, hi Crystal. Thank you so much for doing this collab. I think this is super fun. It is called the Vividly Art Show collaboration. And the idea is, is that on the first of every month, we post a project or something that we've made, something that we've done that was inspired by an artist that we like. The artist that I chose today is Francis Bacabia, and he is a French um, avant-garde artist. My favorite style of his art is what is called his transparencies, and I just love them. The one that I'm inspired by today is um, this one here. It's called Lunaris. I just, I just love it. I love so much about it that I could talk about this painting for a long time and, and sort of the feelings it gives me and the interpretations I have, but I will save you from that. Um, and this one I think was painted sometime in the late 1920s and I just love the feeling of this painting. So what I came up with here and I, I just I painted it on a piece of chipboard you guys just a scrap piece of chipboard um, and this is what I came up with and it may not be I mean obviously I'm not a famous French avant-garde artist um, but I love painting and I love making things and um, I'm actually happy with this this little girl here and her sort of um, depth of layers of flowers and what have you. <laughs> and anyway, this is what I made to show today. And I hope that you guys will take a moment to go check out Crystal's channel. Check out the hashtag and see what everyone else is making. And I really hope you'll join in. You know, what? who's your favorite artist? What do you, have they made that have has inspired you to make something else? You know, for me, I love painting because there's always that moment, <laughs> at least for me, when you're painting, when you apply something to your canvas or your chipboard or what have you, and you have that moment where you go, oh, that's it. I've just ruined it. I've completely <laughs> muddied this up. Uh, there's no recovering from this. This is just awful. And it is really a lesson in you know, determination and commitment and just to keep moving forward because as you continue to add those layers, it may not be exactly what you had envisioned, but it always eventually turns into something that you that you like, or at least something you you almost like. Um, I will say there have been a lot of times that I've painted things and I hated it when I was done, packed it away in a closet somewhere and came across it, you know, months or even years later and thought, huh, that was actually pretty good. I don't know why I hated it so much. Um, so I just think for me, painting is a lesson in patience. It's a lesson in commitment. It's a lesson in time and the sort of um, evolution of things. And I just really love I love it. So I hope that you guys um, are finding some inspiration in something, maybe an artist that you like or in uh, looking at the other creators and, and what they've submitted for this hashtag. And like I said, I hope you hop on over there and join in on the fun, you know, post something that you that that you're inspired by. I would love to see them. So um, I am going to follow this with a little process video. So if you're interested, you can watch my moments where I was like, oh, gosh, this is really bad. <laughs> and how it sort of came about. Um, and you might think it's really bad right now. And that's OK. I'm happy with it. And it was fun for me to get to sort of explore um, a different style of 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 painting for me while I appreciate um, the artwork very, very much. Um, I've never really painted in that style before. I've never really done anything in that, in that way. So it was kind of a fun little exploration for me. So thank you so much for hosting this, Crystal. This has been super fun. So once again, I hope you hop on over and check out her channel. She's got some great things. I really love all of the crafts and artwork and, and things that she makes herself and, and posts, but also the collabs that she hosts is just a great way to meet other crafty friends and, and learn about their process and things that they like. And yeah, I just love it all. So anyway, here's that um, quick little process video following. I hope you guys are having a great day. Day. I hope that you are being kind to yourselves and I really hope that you are finding some joy in your journey as well. Thanks so much y'all. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.